The big freeze of 2021 was one for the record books, and it started with a cold front moving through the U.S. Now, this brought some very chilly Arctic air to the northern tier of the U.S., but this cold front was so strong, it kept pushing farther and farther south. Eventually, by Wednesday, February 10th, the cold front had moved through Texas, but the coldest air was yet to arrive, and we didn't actually get a taste of that Arctic air in Texas until February 11th, the Thursday. Northern Texas started to see that frigid air moving through but again, this was a strong cold front and it brought that Arctic air all the way through to South Texas, including right here in the coastal bend, arriving around Valentine's Day Sunday and continuing on into that week. So we broke a number of temperature records here in Corpus Christi, February 14th, 15th, 16th, 19th and 20th. We had record cold low temperatures. These were records set back in the 1800s in some cases and it didn't stop there. We had record cold high temperatures too. the afternoon high on February 15th, only 31 degrees, breaking the old record of 33 set back in 1895. We would also break a record the next day at 33 degrees, breaking the previous record of 36. Now on top of the cold, we had wintry mix falling from the sky. Some ice accumulations across the area focused across portions of Nueces and San Patricio counties. In fact, at Corpus Christi International Airport, we reported a trace amount of snow. It was a very small amount it's not enough to be measurable, but enough to make for a record here across the coastal bend. Now, talking about what we usually expect during the winter, our average last freeze is actually February 15th. The earliest on record, Halloween of 1993. The latest, March 31st, 1987. And last winter, our first freeze happened on December 22nd of 2022. And our last freeze happened on February 11th, 2023. Now, as we look ahead, it looks like the last of the freezing weather is behind us as we get closer and closer to spring.